day after a cold snap like this, if it stays a little cold, they like to gobble. They get used to it. We got some absolutely burning it down already. So we're gonna slip in here and get on. Hopefully we get some revenge. I think it's the same birds that I whiffed on the other day. So hopefully they can get a little bit of revenge. So we're gonna get on them. You'll see too. Of course. Yeah, he's got one good. He might be coming. Just a minute. He stays in that one spot. We're gonna walk around and get down on the side of the truck. Or the side of the ditch he's on. Right, the bird might float down on the left side of the ditch. We're gonna make a move on him. We're gonna walk back down here, cross the ditch with him. He just won't hit across the ditch. It's a big ditch. Absolutely confused. No, no way that works on me. Maybe. I don't think so. Yeah, the same.
long beard number three down, son. Yes, sir. Didn't move a muscle. What a hunt, buddy. Came in silent as a mouse. The only thing I ever heard was him drumming and spitting, and he gobbled it at 60 yards. There, he's down right there, buddy. 25 yards. Let's go get my bird. Oh, God. What a hunt that was. Ooh, I didn't miss him. Man. Man. It's number three down, baby. Man, what a hunt. I, I think you can see him. He's flopping. Let's go get my bird. Let's go get my bird. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at him right here. Look at him. Look at him. Let's see what those hooks are. You got some hooks on him? What a hunt. I'm almost certain you can see him on camera. Good God, that was fun. Man, I thought he was gone. I was over there mad. Didn't know what was going on. He hadn't gobbled in a while. And I heard a and I said, oh, he's close. And I couldn't see him for the longest time. And I gave him a little bitty softy up and that son of a gun gobbled at me right there. And he came straight in. I moved up. I was sitting on that big old oak tree right there. Right there. And he, uh, oh, he came straight in to me. He never saw me. I just didn't have a bat. He couldn't see my outline at all. And uh, I moved on him. Put my gun up on him and there he lays let's see what those hooks are he got over inch hooks that is what i'm talking about good bird i'm proud of him i'm proud of him that's a good bird to end the year on it's been a stressful year missed one missed two <clears throat> i didn't miss him he read the book he read the script came straight in spitting and drama god i hope you can see him on the camera i'm almost certain you can <clears throat> all right well we're gonna enjoy this one uh, that was fun man what a hunt what a hunt it's number three down. Now it's time to get ready to go up north, northwest. Dad just texted me and said, are you hearing any? And then he texted me back and said, I guess so. Did you get him? You cannot beat this man. You cannot beat Turkey Hunt. Good thick beard. I've been strutting it off. I mean, he's only about a eight or so inch beard, but I don't mind. Big old turkey. Look at those spurs. Got some good hooks on him. In an inch, maybe a little bit over an inch, actually. Good sharp spurs. Good bird. I am proud, proud, proud in the year on that one, man. That's why you got to stay put. I mean, I knew I didn't booger that bird. I knew there was no way. I mean, look at all this stuff he had to see through, and he was about 200 yards. So I sat there and was still for I don't know 20 minutes or so, and I heard a I heard something walking first, so. I, Threw the camera on real quick. Now here, and he was spinning, drumming the whole way. He just didn't want to gobble. He's an older bird. But look at these wings, man. Look how pretty he is. And his tips. He's got some bronze, bronze, really almost white tips. Beautiful bird. He's gonna go. I mean, he's a bigger bird. He's gonna go 19 to 20 pounds, if I had to guess. <clears throat> Definitely no two-year-old. That's for dang sure. That's why he's coming in silent and didn't gobble the whole way in. He just spit and drum the whole way in. He gobbled right there. When I soft called to him at 60 yards, I knew. I was like, that's him. <sighs> what a hunt. You can see. There's no way that bird was seeing me. I mean, this is where I'm sitting up against that huge oak tree. There's no way. I shot through that right there. There's no way that bird was seeing me. I was tucked in there. <clears throat> Camouflage as could be. Good setup. I'm glad I got on this side of the ditch of him. That's uh, he flew down on one on that side of the ditch, and that's just I knew that was a bad setup, so I moved over here. And <clears throat> lo and behold, it worked out absolutely perfectly. So, look at that. I don't care when, I, when I'm 85 years old, I will never get old, but I'll still enjoy every minute of it. Got a little extra weight to carry to the truck this morning. But that's all right with me. Ain't too terribly far. Look at those hooks. He's got some good ones. Good spur. Good beard. It's all around good turkey. Good eastern bird. Love those tips. This one's definitely going on the wall. 
he's definitely getting caped out when as soon as I get back and he's going right up on the wall we'll have a beautiful cape can't wait to see it I ain't there's so many ditches off of here I gotta find my way out of here sick as a dog this morning thought about not coming hot this morning but that's why you do it that's why we do it this right here this is a switch you never know when it's gonna be your morning this morning was my morning what's so funny is, is we came down here and called and everything last night this bird was right by us he never said a peep he said a peep this morning said too many peeps I was scared he was a Jake but uh because we've been hunting some I've been some bull jakes in here got pictures of them hearing them seeing them but when I heard that spitting drum and he gobbled at 60 yards I was like no way and then I saw that full fan come over the, t the hill there and I knew he wasn't no Jake so what a hunt